What's up, you evil villains? It's your boy, Luis Torres, and I now have the Horizon Devices Tokyo Drive. So apparently, this is exactly like the Precision Drive. Uh, it's just all in Japanese. And there was a limited run. So this is number 814 of 1,000 that were made. From my understanding, from what I've read, people just went ahead and ordered the Precision Drive, and this ended up showing up. So uh, it seemed like there was a limited run of 1,000, but only a few people actually received it, and it's not like they had a choice. It's, I don't know if they were just like, what else do we have to give all these people buying them? Oh shit, we only have a thousand left, so let's just send them these. So, um, it's an absolutely amazing pedal. It's interesting because I was considering the uh, the the newer, uh, is what is it, the, the, uh, the Apex, right? The Apex um, preamp. This thing is absolutely amazing. So, let me plug it in. I'm actually using my PV6505-112. Uh, this thing I actually have loaded with a Celestion V30. So if you have a 6505 with a Sheffield, take that Sheffield, pull it out, throw that thing in the garbage, get yourself a Celestion V30. You're going to absolutely love it. It's sick. Today I'm using my 2014 Paul Reed Smith Custom 22 uh, Leprechaun Tooth, and it's a 10 top. So let's see. setup is I'm using my um, rhythm channel and I have my bass to max my treble to three o'clock and my mid to zero and the reason why I have it set to zero is because I'm actually using the pedal to sweep that mid section um, and it sounds amazing I mean you can hear there's actually one little uh, dial uh, where you can adjust the brightness from it so you can hear it Thank you. 
So if you haven't tried the Precision Drive, get it, because it's a sick pedal, especially since, I mean, this is the Tokyo Drive. The only difference is that it's like $100 more. Um, I didn't pay for it. I actually had, remember, you guys remember my little Diablo RD1H, which was the single watt? Uh, so someone in my town, um, I actually had it on Craigslist, and he was just like, hey, I actually have the, um, the, uh, the Tokyo Drive, so I quickly just Googled it and I was like, ah, I don't know what the heck that is, um, but it's made by Horizon Devices, so let me just do a little research and um, literally 15 minutes later, we drove up and uh, met up uh, at a Stewart's, uh, which is a New York staple, upstate New York, um, little like convenience shop and, you know, traded and I reached out to him a few minutes after uh, I played it, and I was just like, dude, this thing's absolutely amazing. And he's like, I fucking hated it. So, but he loved the, uh, the Randall Diablo, so it was like a perfect match, because I already have the uh, RD100H. I didn't need two Diablos, so. But I do have two Diablos. I have a Satan and a Diablo, so I actually still do have two Diablos. Um, so yeah, absolutely amazing. I'm actually using my uh, Fort and Zool um, with that. I connected my ISP Decimator 2 and the Decimator doesn't do absolutely anything to it. So I don't know why there's a, a ton of feedback, but uh, if you don't have the Fort and Zool, get it. Even though the uh, Tokyo Drive and the Precision Drive both have a built-in uh, noise gate, you do just keep, keep it at zero because it's it's not that good um great pedal it's hard to have a built-in noise gate with a pedal although they say it's designed for the pedal and it's supposed to work better uh, i actually have it set to zero because on or zero it's exactly the same thing the fortins will actually takes care of it whereas the isp decimator 2 doesn't do anything um so it's really interesting so Again, PV6505, 112, and yes, if you have it, those are wheels. Yo, if you have one, you know how heavy that thing is. Yo, that thing is heavy. So go get yourself a three-quarter inch drill. Drill that thing in. Go get yourself some Ernie Ball uh, uh, casters, and that's it, dude. You'll never have to pick that thing up. You just slide it all over the place. Um, but yeah, definitely get the Horizon Devices uh, Tokyo Drive. It's a little more expensive. I don't know why, other than it's a different color, different colored knobs, and you kind of have to memorize what the four knobs are for because they're in Japanese. So, <laughs> uh, But definitely check that out. If you don't get that pedal, definitely get the Precision Drive uh, by uh, Horizon Devices. Uh, I think you'll really like it. And like anything, you got to adjust your, your amp so it works with that pedal. But uh, if you're a chug master, <laughs> then you're going to love that, uh, that pedal and the amp, even though that thing, people hate it. The 6505-112, because it was made in China, yo, that thing is legit, so you can get that too. All right, everyone, listen, if you haven't subscribed, click on that thing. Yo, seriously, it takes you two seconds. Boop, 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 go click on it. Yo, why, you haven't done it yet. Do it. Come on, jerk. Just do it. Okay. <laughs> All right, everyone, listen, you guys are the best. Thank you so much, and as usual, I will talk to you guys soon. Click it. Click on it. It's right, it's right there.